Now let the suffer game begin, boys. Above the wall, boom. Let us just kill the int mood. What is my dude doing? Can I hit him? Yeah, I got another int mood. You'll have to see it. What is up, guys, and welcome to the Beyond Sanity. I'm Benny Mishings. In today, we're gonna play Isengard versus Seven Heart Rohans in Battle for Middle Earth One on the page 2.22 on the beautiful map Old Brownlands, which, by the way, is going to be way harder than playing and winning with Gondor or Rohan because we have no walls. The AI on the patch 2.2 is way harder than in the previous versions. And our base is a pot, you know, like a danger zone from the minute one. We have zero protection. That means we need to be extremely fast. And speed is going to be the key to victory. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to actually pick up the Warchant from the spellbook. Grab this one and creep this one right off the bat. It's going to be very important. Every money, every single cent we can take is going to be needed. I mean, I didn't watch and oh my goodness. Okay, I forgot. Okay, let's use the formation to get a bit more tankiness. We can now use one of the workers to send it to this second uh, settlement. And just be time efficient, you know. I mean, luckily later on, we need, we're going to be kind of in a good spot. Once those furnaces are hitting level 3, they will become way tankier. You will also get a chance to shoot, which is very important. But until this is going to happen, okay, let's just creep this completely until this is gonna happen we are we need to be kind of careful i mean normally the ai doesn't want to give us the time to do that stuff you can also scout with this worker to see what's going on and i'm gonna still build towers for now before anything else uh oh i mean he combined units too by the way did you see that he is combining peasants with the yeoman archers let's attack from behind I'm gonna build another tower here. Come on, get level 2 fast. Ah, come on. Nah, we couldn't get level 2. Oh my goodness, here they come, boys. Here they come. Hmm. I don't know. Might be... Might be kind of bad, though. <laughs> I mean, let's see if we can survive that. I mean, let's be honest. If they build Entmut right now, I'm defeated. There is little to nothing I can do about this situation. I mean, sometimes you need to kind of hope that they don't have the money yet. But remember, AI has like crazy money boost, you know? I need to build a Uruk pit and a furnace and build towers, just full towers. We have almost the power points for the industry, which is very important. Just throw the sword and fight this. Okay, we have industry, that's good. Let's use it right off the bat. Again, it will be helpful to get them to level 2, level 3 way, way faster. And we need to kind of use Lourdes as a bait, you know? I mean, all you need to do is kill the peasants first. I mean, the melee units, they are the ones who are dealing damage. The archers, they don't deal damage to the buildings until they will have the fire arrows, which is going to take them some time. But if you show them the Lourdes, they will kind of get, uh, you know, tempted to attack your Urukai instead of attacking your bees most of the time, not always. But, you know, it's still looking really, really rough. Let's beat them in. Too many peasants are coming, man. Too many peasants. I'm gonna get this two crossbow men here. Come on, get level three, please, fast, please, fast. I see Rohirrim coming also. Oh man, they're gonna trample me, won't they? I think they do. And these are Rohirrim archers, okay, that's fine. Let's recruit now two Uruks to combine them with the crossbow men. That's very important. Lourdes is gonna get some more experience. And luckily they are getting beaten in. And also luckily for us, they didn't build int moods there. I mean, when this happens, just, you know, quit the game. Because you cannot win this then, you know? That's not possible. Especially not early game. Mid to lead game, when you have fire arrows, it's going to be way, way better. But until this is going to happen, the second you see ends, insta leave the game. Trust me on that one. I'm going to put loads next to this. I'm gonna. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to use war chants. And hope that my Lourdes is going to get level 5 very, very soon. And you see, that's the power spike I was talking about. Level 3 furnaces with 5,500 HP. And every single one of them is going to now be able to shoot. I need to go for Devastation, actually. I'm going to go for Devastation. Because the fuel of Fires is going to be kind of useless. And we don't need Reen right now. 
Come on, shoot, shoot, shoot. We have enough more Saruman. That's good. Demolish this. In armory. There we go. They're kind of broke, though. They're really, really broke. I mean, our bi oh, he has fire arrows too. That's really bad. So I need to manually focus these units with the fire arrow. There comes Aragorn, Araton's son. Oh, man. Oh, what are, what are these Uruks doing? Cripple him. Cripple him. Okay, nice. That's good. Now we can hardcore focus him. If also Saruman up on the field. I'm gonna use Fireball in him next to Lourdes. And Lourdes got level 5, you see? That's called passively leveling up. Oh, he has even... Man, he has even the horseman shields. Can you imagine that? Armory, we need this, this, this. We need actually everything beside the bleeds. We don't need the bleeds for now. Let's level them up if we can. Okay, one of them got level 2. That's good. Actually, both of them got level 2. It's, oh, he just for Hulk Strike our tower, this Legolas. And by the way, we will have to eventually face again seven Legolas, seven Aragorn, seven three beards. Oh, oh, not, 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 not. Okay, this guy has like a crazy range. And he's hardcore focusing my heroes. They are coming from everywhere, dude. They are coming from everywhere. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hide this level two units behind because I don't want to lose them. They're kind of very valuable, so, but we can keep this one. You see? Gimli, Aragorn, Legolas, everybody. I'm gonna fireball this dude. I mean, too much, too much force, too much, too much distraction. Run, 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 run. I mean, this guy's even, uh, you know, Gimli and Aragorn with Andori sword. This is so rough, dude. This is so rough. Please kill this Rohirrim. Okay, nice. We crippled him. They are just too tanky. <laughs> These units are just too tanky. Kill him first. Yeah, yeah. kill him first. Oh my god, he just leaped on us. I'm gonna demolish this. Don't kill my level 3 furnace, please. Just don't do it. He did it. He did it. I mean, Aragorn is so tanky. He's tanking automatically all the towers we got. All of them. Blast them. Okay, nice. I lost my lords somehow. I didn't even pay attention to that. My bad. Need Lourdes back on the on the menu very very fast. Bring this unit. Oh man, too many units, <laughs> too many units. My towers they cannot stay there for a long time. I need my Lourdes back on the menu very very fast. And because I've like lost almost every single furnace of mine, I need to also pay so much money for the upgrades because the furnaces are also giving us the steel bonus. But we have almost the Balrog. Even though the Balrog is going to be great, but I don't think it's going to be enough. What are we going to do with Balrog? When we destroy a full castle, which we normally can't, we have not even the situation or the money to buy it instantly back, you know, for us. And even if we, if we can somehow find a way to buy it, we don't have any way to protect it. What I need is I need my... I'm, I'm going to fireball this dude, actually. Okay, we almost killed him in a second. Which is pretty good. Let's fireball this. Let's make more towers around this side too. It, I, I'm happy when Gimli is fighting me. My units are recovering a little bit. That's good. We can send these units now back. Because they are badly damaged. And get these units in once again. We need to do this all the time by the way. That's very important, you know. Gimli is so tanky man. That's unbelievable. Come on, Lourdes, I need you. I need Lourdes' leadership. That's very important. I know I keep saying very important because I'm really, really stressed, you know? When I'm stressed, I repeat the same thing over and over again. Okay, nice. So we have Lourdes. Let's kill this, please. Lourdes needs to be level 6 for the pillage, right? Yeah. 
I'm gonna put Lourdes next to this army. So now, we're gonna make money for killing enemy units, which is very, very good. And also very needed. Let's upgrade them all. Nice, nice with that blast, that's good. Um, protect the heroes, you don't want to lose them. And we have enough power points for the Balrog already, long time ago. Okay, that's fine. Let's kill this Aragorn now. I mean, killing heroes like Aragorn is going to give us so many power points, you know? Uh, so many, so much money from the pillage of Lourdes. I'm going to use heal here, let's go. Too many Rohan heroes, which, which are very, very powerful. The good thing is, the more experience we get with the units, the way the more stronger they will get, right? They will become way, way stronger, but there are Rohirrim with full upgrades. I'm not going to use Speechcraft on that one, to be honest with you. I mean, units are quite tanky. We need to kill Gimli. There is a Legolas too. Shooting from downtown. Look how tanky Gimli is. That's unbelievable. We need to kill Legolas first. Oh, what, what are they doing? Why are you walking into that? Don't do this to me. I mean, we can extend the command points limits this way quite easily, actually. Now, around the base, we can turn and fight. Let's group them up a little bit. So we can use Speechcraft. Because... Two of them are still not level 10. Oh man. Too much. Too much destruction. I'm gonna use Fireball on this dude. Go back, Legolas, to the shadows. You are not Gandalf. You cannot block this. Lourdes has to stay closer to the combos. I mean, it's kind of like an awkward situation, right? Because I we have now a great army, but I don't think we can leave the army yet. I need to kind of wait until these furnaces are also hitting level 3 before I can make a move. Because they are attacking literally from everywhere. Yes, even Elven Warriors with Fire Rose. Damage my unit. Yeah, damage him. Damage him. I want him to damage that. Because then I can get another Uruk from this uh, Uruk pit. Be nice. Okay, now, hold on. Okay, I have an idea now. What I'm gonna do, hold on a second. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get these units, these two damage units, these and this and this. I'm gonna send them back. And I'm gonna group this new fresh blood with my Uruks and with my Saruman and Lords. I'm gonna leave this three in the base for the defense and with the other three I will have to make an um, offensive move finally. We have so many power points, but I'm really, really scared to leave my base alone. I need to at least wait until they are able to regenerate, you know? Because Gimli especially is such a big problem, as he's so resistant against arrow damage. He can literally tank everything from us for ages and ages on end. I'm gonna need to cripple him. Okay, nice. Let's use Warchant here. Okay, nice. Look, Gimli is tanking all the damage in the meantime. Saruman is level 10. That's good. Lourdes has to be very close to the army. That's the most important part. He's providing 60% damage constantly, as long as he's nearby. Okay, these are level 3 too. Okay. I think that's gonna be the time for me to make a move. Okay, I have now two armies. That's very good. Kill Gimli, please. Dude, this is unbelievable. This dude is so tanky. Okay, nice. Finally. When you play against Rohan, it's very important to not destroy the farms. Because when you destroy the farms, you give them the option and the chance to get just multiple end moods upon the field. And you don't want that to happen. Trust me on that one. That's, I mean, you can deal with them, it's not the problem, but it's just so annoying to fight constantly against multiple end moods. They won't stop building end moods at some point of the game. You will have to, you will have to hear the sound of the ends pretty much non-stop. That's why it's much more, much better when you, hold on a second, let's get all these power points because we have all of them. I'm gonna use, um, Balrog summon right on the spot. 
Let's level them up. Okay, let's send in Balrog. He's closing the gate. Um, I need to destroy the gate. Oh, don't, 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 don't kill the farm. Don't kill the farm. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill the gate actually. But let's use the breath fire first on the production buildings. I need to kill the gate, man. Because I don't have any siege weapons and I have like no command points to recruit any siege weapons. Okay. Okay, nice. We did, we did, we did it. That's good. I'm gonna use War Chant because I'm taking way too much damage for no reason. Come on. He healed. My Balrog summon was not very good. I don't know if he can finish it. Like, he has very, very powerful heroes here. Let's kill the easier ones first, like Aragorn and Legolas. Then kill Gimli, and then we can go for a Visa Plus here, right on the spot. Take this. That was a beautiful Visa Plus. Kill Gimli too. That's good. Okay, now what we're gonna do is we need to go inside. Also, keep an eye on the main base. Again, we have like three combos protecting the base, and one of them is even level 10, so it should not be the worst thing in the world. And we need to get in there before... Oh my goodness, stop it. I cannot lose my Saruman. That's gonna be the worst thing ever when I lose him. Let's kill the buildings first. Before it's rebuilding. Let's kill the well so he cannot heal up. Now we can kill the army first before anything else. Split slow. You don't need to rush anything. But Saruman is very important. We need to keep him alive. No matter what. Okay, hold on. I think it's kind of pointless to actually kill his <laughs> units. Because he has like crazy production speed. He's producing units before I can even kill them. So just focus on the buildings. So one of them is going to be defeated. But now the question is, how are we going to handle the rest of them? You know, that's what I'm worried about. Because I cannot split yet another army. You know, it's not possible. I mean, he's hard focusing my Saruman, by the way. But we have almost the Villa of Saruman back. Come on. Come on. Oh, that was close. It was really, really close, actually. He almost did it. Okay. I mean, again, don't kill the farms. That's very important, boys. That's less... I mean, when you play it for the first time, you can try to kill it, but then you will regret your life, you know? What is happening here, man? Why, this, why does he have so many units on the field? Oh, I didn't pay attention to my... Oh, he has Legolas somewhere, right? I think he has a hero somewhere. No, he doesn't. I need to revive him ASAP. I, I saw Aragorn, but it's okay. Our Saruman is also giving leadership, and we also were able to save this level 9 unit, which is also very, very important. He has even heavy armor. Uh, he doesn't let me buy this. I'm gonna use actually. Hold on. I'm gonna use War Chant here. I will have to use War Chant to kill him a bit faster. And I think what I also need to do is I need to buy Forge Bleeds on him. Come on, just kill this. Yeah, okay, just buy it. Nice, nice, nice. We did it. Okay, what I'm gonna do here. Hold on. There comes the Intimut, by the way. I warned you guys. I mean, we didn't even destroy it, but because we actually... Hold on, what is the... K, K, K. I'm gonna build two towers here. Three towers, actually. Another one here. Oh, my. Yep, yep, that's exactly what I was talking about. But that was a beautiful fireball. We actually burned two of them at the same time. Oh, man. Let this suffer begin. I let the suffer game begin, boys. Okay, we need... There is another end mood coming. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, you know? That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, I cannot... I cannot hold this. Oh, I'm not gonna lose... I'm not gonna lose the level 10. Don't... Won't I? Okay, I cannot lose the level 10. 
You see the production speed of this ends? That's the scary part, you know, that's the most scary part actually about this. Because they can produce them in a, in a second and a half. Just don't lose the level 10. Please don't lose the level 10. Just go back. Just go back. Oh my goodness, too many ends coming. I need to use Warchant here. Because some of them are even permanent ends. I think. Yeah. And you see, even though I was paying attention to that, where is my Lourdes? Okay, Lourdes, come on, I need you. I need more crossbow men. But I'm command points kept, that's the problem. And another guy bought the castle. Yeah, that's unbelievable. <laughs> that's unbelievable. All I need is more crossbow men. But I cannot afford it. I mean, I just lost like... Kill this 3 please. It's like, lost so much money, man. That's unbelievable. There is another tree bit, by the way. And they are throwing rocks while Legolas is kind of slaughtering our army. What am I, what is my, what are my units doing? Just kill tree beard. Don't walk into the tree beard. Just kill him. The ends are so painful to deal with. It's unbelievable. Run. I mean, the problem is, if he's able to destroy that one, this slaughterhouse, he will yet build another one, you know? I think I'm gonna just recruit crossbow men and not combos, because I need more firepower. I mean, he's chasing me all the time. Don't lose the level 10, please. I need to heal to not lose the level 10. They are hunting my level 10 units all the time. Use Warchant. Speechcraft. And spam more, more, more. Oh man, <laughs> this is so tough. Okay, I need to see something though. Okay, that, that's a red Rohan. There is another end coming. Kill the end first. The end party, boys. The end party. But I have like lots of units recovering. That's good. I, I think I didn't lose any level 10 unit. But the question is, what am I going to do against those ends? I'm going to actually use this breath. Uh, use this Balrog here. Because I'm just tilted, you know? Okay, he's burning. I'm, I'm gonna ignore him. I need to fly one more time. I need to kill the gate. Don't do don't lose him. Can I kill the git? Yes. I don't think I can use the speechcraft. I mean the say it ability. But yeah, I couldn't use it. But he's repairing the gate, can you imagine that? But it's so tilting. <laughs> and that's what I'm talking about, you know, the AI is so much, much, much better now than they were before. Don't lose the level 7 crossbow man, okay? Our level 10s are very strong, but are they strong enough? That's the... That's the biggest issue we have. I don't need to heal them. Actually, I'm gonna heal them anyway, so they're gonna be full HP. We need to kill the ants. Did he rebuild the end mood? Of course he did. Of course he did. What a question. What a question. And they're all throwing rocks. Can you believe that? Now. 
Yeah, I one-shot at the end with them. I mean, this Legolas is so annoying too. I'm gonna kill him next. He's level 1, but he's still dealing so much damage. I hear Ents crying all the time, bro. All the time. What can men do against such a reckless Ent war? The battle for Middle Earth 1 and the Ent game. I'm just gonna go to this location. I mean, normally, when the AI buys a second castle, they don't close the gate. So, I hope that this is gonna be the case that they didn't that they don't close the gate and I just can simply walk in and finish him off. I mean there is another Legolas. This Legolas are so annoying. Okay. I don't need to use speechcraft because literally yeah, every single one of them is level 10. But I can use Visa Plus here. Okay. My fortune is almost back up. I need to kill the ants mood. He keeps recruiting more ants. And that will be the case non-stop. So just kill the ants ant mood first. Can I heal? Come on. Can I use it? Okay. Just kill everything here first. I can use Warchan almost. Oh, Gimli. But even Gimli cannot withstand this now. Look, it's a level 1 Gimli. He's gonna get crushed in a second. But we need to kill the ants. Yeah, we are strong now. Holy moly. We are one-shotting everything. And the level 10 power. That's very good. Shoot at them. Come on now. I don't pay attention to my Saruman. <laughs> they are coming from everywhere. I'm just gonna ignore them actually. Hold on. I need to kill this end. Fireball right on top of the wall. Boom. That was a beautiful fireball. Where are these ends coming from, man? Where is this Fiesta? Look, he's trampling me. Let's kill three beards. I need to kill the ant mood. That's what I need to do. But first of all, let's kill three beard. And then kill this ant mood. Nice. Beautiful. Saruman. Just kill the ant mood. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, just walk into the media range. Just why not? That, sound, that sounds like a very good idea. Luckily, our units are so strong. <laughs> that you can see the quality beats quantity indeed. And we have almost Balrog pick up. But can you imagine what will happen if the AI gets the chance to summon the EOD? I mean, likely they don't get the chance to kill a lot from us. But still. I'm gonna use Tainted Land actually. Just for more armor. Come on, man. Don't stop moving. Just fight. The war chant. Now I'm gonna be very, very strong. There is a Gimli in my base tanking all the towers forever and ever and ever. Okay. Let's walk in now. Let's just walk in. Now the question is, will they build? Yeah, of course they do. Of, they, of course they do. And I, I don't even know what I can do to prevent it from happening, you know? That they cannot build end moods. Like, I, I think there is nothing I can do about that. Just focus on the buildings, please. I hear the ends. I hear the ends. Don't worry about it. And there is going to be another end mood. There is going to be eventually another end mood. And so on. Just focus on the buildings, please. There is, yeah, you see? That's what I was talking about. Another int mood. Maybe I should not buy any castle when I think about it. Maybe I should just destroy them until the last building like that and then just leave and hope that they won't rebuild because the thing is, even if I buy this, 
they will destroy it. If I dis if I then they will take it. You know, when I destroy it completely and don't buy it, don't buy it, then they will just take it. I'm just gonna go now for the second piece, for this piece actually. I think that's the best thing I can do. Just wait for the army to group and fight a little bit. The ends are chasing us all the time. Okay, just just keep going. Okay, the ends are coming to this location now, but I think we have enough protection here. <gasps> oh my goodness. Keep walking, keep walking, keep walking. They are chasing. What the heck are they doing? They are trampling all of our units. I just lost like a lot of the units, man. Oh boy. Level 10, don't die. Kill him. And more of them are coming. That's so nice, dude. What is this, man? Are they ca they're coming before I can destroy the other ones. I'm gonna use the Balrog here. And I just go back. Balrog, please fly inside the jeans. Come on. I can't even pay attention. That's so exhausting. Don't let them destroy. Yeah, throw rocks at me. That sounds like a very good idea. Okay, let's peel with this army. I cannot afford to lose it. Let's peel, please. Just run. Just run. Just run this way. Okay, I need to reinforce this group. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep this army, this one only. This, 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 and my Saruman, plus all of these together and all the other ones going back don't lose the level 10 don't lose the level 10 take this fireball yeah throw a rock at me three beards you fool Okay, use, I'm lucky that this guy is not building, rebuilding. That's a good thing. When you when you know that uh, AI buys his second base, then they don't normally act there the same way they normally act. <laughs> if this makes any sense. But I'm just trying to say. Like, in their, in their primary base, they will act way better, way, way smarter. But in their second castle, what they buy, it's not going to be the case. Oh man, they keep attacking also from this location. I'm just gonna ignore and hopefully I will... I'm gonna use the Palantir to get speed. It didn't rebuild the gate, so I can just... I think I can just go in here. What is the speed, man? What is the speed, man? He's just trampling everything off me! He's just turbo rushing me, man! Look, he's repa repairing, you see? That's why we need to be fast. We need to be fast. Yeah, spear throw me, dude. That's very good from you. Spear throw me. Kill him. Kill her, I mean. It's not time. Okay, are they all in? I think they are all in. Just kill the building fast. Before more of them are coming. What is happening here? Just fight this back. Oh. Did I lose one of my level 10? I think I did. I think I did. Oh man, they, they are also gonna... Okay, nah, never mind. I didn't. I didn't. I cannot let Entmut build here, by the way. That's... I cannot do this. Did I defeat one of them? I defeated only one. Hold on. I think the person who has this one... Yeah, I think so. But it's fine. That, that means... Look, I have an idea. 
I'm gonna build towers here, four towers. We don't, we're not gonna, we, we're just gonna kill the Entmut. Build towers. Money is not a problem because we get so much money and value from, um, from Lourdes Pillage. Oh, don't, 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 please don't. Run, 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 run. Did I lose the level 10? I think I did. I lost one of them. What is happening with my main base in the meantime? Yeah, I know what's happening. It's getting slaughtered. Completely slaughtered. The ends are kind of immune to all the, what, I, what, what I have done. What have I done? There is a permanent end in my beast too. Just kill the ends, please. Burn them at least. Shoot them one time so they can burn. I needed to do that. Oh my, I need to go all the way back now to my base, huh? Because there is another Entmut coming and I cannot defend this Entmut at all. Oh boy. Oh boy, what is this fiesta? Kill three beard. Just kill the Entmut. What is my doing? Can I hit him? Yeah, I got another end, Mood. You'll have to see it. I mean, I, I don't know, maybe I made a mistake, but you see, I destroyed the end mood, they instantly buy again. Uh, maybe I should just not make combos, maybe I should just make raw crossbow man, but still, you know. But even then, I don't think it would be a full different story. Yeah, you see, they built another end mood immediately. But what can you do against such a requisite? Tell me, what can you do against such a requisite? They're gonna build another end mood eventually here. But they don't even need to see how many ends. End mood is so tanky that not even Balrog's Breathfire can kill it when you have no ignite. Can you please finish off the farm? I'm trying hard to kill this farm. Okay. So at least I will be able to defeat two now. Okay. So from seven, I've defeated two. Five are still remaining, but I know it's going to be a disappointment for you guys, but I cannot do it. I lost my full castle here. I'm about to lose my full castle here. I lost all my level 10 units. And yeah, look how many ends are coming. That's kind of crazy how difficult this is. But, you know, you cannot win every single game. It was a challenge. And, uh, you know what? Let's make a special deal, boys. If we can still somehow get 300 likes on this video, I will try that until I can do it. Okay? And then the next video is going to be me finally being able to beat it. Or I will just keep trying until I can do it. I mean, I'm just going to upload this to see... So you can see the nightmare and the differential between the 2.22 patch and the 1.06 patch. You can see the speed difference, the recruit times difference, you see how many ends, he's just buying the castle in front of my face, in front of my Saruman, just see how insane the AI got, you know, become in the BFM1 in the patch 2.2. Thanks for watching, <laughs> sorry for the disappointment, hope to see you next time, until then, take care of yourselves, keep hitting like a truck, and as always, stay beyond standards, unlike in this game. Peace out.